Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the Uncle Bandit stream. I hope everyone's doing well and staying safe out there. I am having a pretty all right day today. Today has been pretty, pretty low key, all told. I am. Um, I got some holiday themed goodies on my end, so I'm I'm pretty thrilled about that. And uh, yeah, things things have been all right. Uh, speaking of holiday themed goodies, today we are continuing our playthrough of Rise, Son of Rome. So without further ado, let us hop back into the video first. Because nothing says holidays like the Roman Empire. Anyway, before we begin, I kind of wanted to note something. Um, so as you might notice, um, the premium currency up there, the little coins, uh, is a lot more than last time. So the reason that is, is because I decided to poke around the, uh, the Xbox Marketplace, right? Because this game does have DLC to it, but it's all like, I don't know, like multiplayer, co-op kind of stuff. Nothing really essential for like a playthrough of this. And I noticed that the premium currency to this game has been set to the low, low price of free. I don't know if that's like, like as of time of recording, all denominations of that you can get of this premium currency is free. <laughs> which which is frankly amazing. So what I decided to do is I decided to get uh, basically the highest domination and just decide to break the um, the, uh, the rest of the progression of the game, honestly. That's, that's the plan. <laughs> if you have a problem with it, oh well. Because I just find this, like, hilarious. <laughs> I, I, don't, I don't know why. I just find something very, very funny about that. In all fairness, though, like, that, like... I will note that that's, like, I guess a cool thing. If you're going to stop, like, supporting a game with these sorts of things... You know, just make the, the, you know, just make the premium currency free so that, like, if there's anything that's, like, exclusive behind it, you know, you don't have to sit there and, like, spend money on a game that's, you know, the developers aren't really supporting anymore. All right, so I've gotten everything. I gotta say, I do like... I didn't mention this the last time. I do like how the progression bars, like, um... Show, like, these scenes. You know? They're probably, like, screen caps from, like, test... From, like, QA or something, but... Like, they're neat. They, they are very neat. Anyway, let us continue our quest for revenge. Look at these rendered areas. Look at that lighting. It's taking a while to load. Game? So how are we doing tonight, chat? You doing good? Are we uh are we pumped for pumped for the holidays? Holidays treating you well. Ah, there Commodus we go. was next. Here at the Colosseum, he would show all Rome his great victories and mm. claim our deeds as his own. Now I would earn the right to fight him and cut this poison from the heart of Rome. Ooh. I would have my vengeance. Yeah, we decided to go full gladiator here. Very, very fun. Anything hiding in the darkness? 
No. There's like a part of me that wants to go searching around for anything hiding about. Ah, like this. But, uh. All right, let's go do arena things. Can't wait to get out there and fight. You don't have a clue. You'll be slaughtered in the first wave. I've fought in every arena. No man's put me down yet. This uh. is the Colosseum. You aren't meant to fight. You are meant to die. Well, oh, well, you doing all right down there? That's fancy. I'm not gonna lie, it kind of felt like it stepped into like a a Final Fantasy game. There. All right, let's fight. Bizarro world version of like what we just went through. I guess. With righteous fury did the almighty Commodus strike down the Britons for their mm. impudence. And light in Dover's take part the eternal flame. Bonk. Slash. Oh, 
Alright, cool. All right, cool. That, that. Thanks. All right, we're in. Now uh, we just gotta light this dumb thing. The thing has been lit. We did it. Yeah, we did it. Oh. Oh. Wow. I gotta say, this is pretty cool. I, I can, I can kind of dig this. The ever-shifting uh, Coliseum. Swiftly did Kamadas move through the forests. Swiftly, like a wolf. Swiftly. Did you hear him? Swiftly, like a... the fern archers of Britain tried to cow great General Commodus. Oh, man. What is on the relenting? Go. Oh, no. Uh, whoops. There wasn't a prompt for it, so I was a little... I was a little... I was taken a little off guard, I guess. The famed archers of Britain tried to cow great General Commodus. All right, come on. The forests of Britannia team with enemies, and the great General Commodore's face alone. Set together. Oh, if you were smart like me, mm. you'd think of this fight in the cold, not the shit. But oh no, you're not, are you? There we go. Just a meat sack, ready to die. Oh, well done, Damocles. Uh, really well done. All right. Uh. The wicked Britons sent forth their greatest warriors. Oh. They thought they could stop the indomitable Commodus. Marvelous, terror warriors, the likes of which you have never seen. Ah, man. <laughs> Oh, well. there we go. Where are your guns now? There we go. Bonk. All right, cool. Ah, man. Nice. Oh, whoops. Hey, that was slick. Done. 
Uh, okay, I guess I. Oh, okay. Oh, whoops. There we go. Oh, silly me. I misremembered. There were actually many more murders. Oh, okay. Feral warriors. Sure. Yeah, now that I don't have to worry about, like, XP gain at all. You know? Uh, I can just sort of leave it on regain health. You know, it, like so it's not really that I want his head. A thousand denarii to whoever brings it to me. Oh well. Done. There we go. Done. Slash. All right, sick. You're done. Oh, you mean this? Yeah, you're welcome. Burn. Whoa. That's a lot of physics objects. Oh. I have vanquished every nation that dared stand against us. I am the greatest general ever to lead Rome and her people. Today, you have had the honor. Yes, the honor of witnessing the slaughter of every gladiator sent in against me. Yeah. We're gonna we're gonna murder him soon. Slain by me! Your general! Your leader! Your savior! We know, I must confess I'm more than a little worried. Why so, my emperor? Uh, Damocles has been fighting like a lion all day. He still looks alarmingly strong. Pin off your son's life, my emperor. Oh. I fear not for that little shit's life, you fool. I fear for my purse. I oh. wanted a fortune on him to win. I will shorten the odds. Your purse is safe. Oh. And so is the little 
shit. What are they playing? Well, here we go. You say you are protecting Rome. Who will protect you from me? Uh. <laughs> okay, where are the heels in this match? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, people are booing. Silence! Come on, Damocles. Take your vengeance. Oh. I'm Commodus, you fool. I'm Commodus. I'm Spartacus. The show's over for you, Damocles. Okay, now there's like... Is it him? Texas. Sick. Yeah, I'm kind of screwing up these uh, QTs. Come on. Ah, oh, man. Bonk. Roll. Stamp. Nope. Oh, man. There we go. Oh, 
Oh, man. Yeah, that always gets me. Is it because I'm not getting, like, health from... Is it him? Yeah, I'm, I'm aware. Ah, dang it. Come on. Nice. Okay. We're good. Come on, you. Come on, you. Ah. All right, well. Come on. Ah. It's that little spin move that kind of screws me up. Yeah, like, what the heck? Alright. All right, this is the stage. Okay. Oh, man. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I, that's... That's tricky. Yeah, I'm aware about perfect display. I promise. Ah, done. Very good. All right. You got me. These wounds, they cannot heal. Ah, man. Oh, man. Ah. I keep getting nailed by stuff, and it's kind of... Come on, you. Come on! Oh, man. Man. Uh, come on, me. Is it him? 
Yeah, I'm aware. Alright, okay. That's one down. Oh, man. Because, like, there's two red attacks that he can do. And there's one of them you can deflect, and the other you really can't. I think there's like four left. Well, there we go. It's not like I can roll out of that uh, state either. Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, come on. Hey, there we go. Took me a few tries, but I did it. Oh. Is this poison gas? More of them. Oh, this is interesting. Yeah, we're we're living. Come on, finish him! Come on! Hey! 
All right, sick. We're uh, we're not giving up too easily. Feel that poison. Can't take any chances, Damocles. You understand? I know I'm immortal, but the plebs can be so fickle. One lucky blow from you and my ring. Aha! Take your last breath, Commodus. Oh no. Yeah, he's he's big dead. Ooh. Fatality. All this victory. I am Damocles. I am Vengeance. You are next. Whoa. Get in. Get oh, in. that spooked him. Nice. Whoa, let him go. Yeah, let him go. Yeah, we're breaking out of here. <laughs> I've only ever known one man who can fight like that. Oh. Hey, it's him. Let us finish what your father started, Marius. Hey. Quickly, we need to get out of here. Yeah, let's go. Town up once again. The Senate is nothing but frightened old men. They no longer listen to truth nor reason. I warned them about Britannia, but to no avail. Yeah, that's rough. Commodus has held the legions back, doing nothing, whilst the massive barbarian army has swarmed across the empire, wreaking havoc as it closes in on Rome. The Britons. Yes. And their army has grown tenfold. Hmm. Everyone who opposes Rome has allied with them. Yeah. Even tribes from faraway lands have sent them massive beasts of war. Is he talking about elephants? Like war elephants? The Emperor and Commodus have made enemies. So many enemies. And across the Empire, these barbarians have seen how weakened we have become under Nero's rule. And they mean to destroy us. Destroy the Empire. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. With Commodus gone, they'll ask me to assume command. And I'll need my best men if we're going to hold Rome. Oh. When I suspected it was you in the arena, I readied this. Oh. The Emperor must die. And he will. But we must save Rome first. Look, we'll kill him later. <laughs> I need you now, Marius. 
Fight for your father. Fight for your legion. Fight for Rome. Ah, <laughs> uh, that, that was something. Boudicca. Once her fate was in my hands, oh. now she spearheaded the army of a thousand tribes. Their giant beasts of war bore oh, down yeah, war elephants. Gates. Cool. The evils of a rotten empire visited upon its capital. We must all answer for our choices, Nero. But it's the people of Rome that now pay for yours. Ah, uh, Boudicca. Your fight was not with Rome itself, but with Nero, who had our fathers murdered. And we will be avenged. But yeah, falls, citation needed on that. And our world will descend into darkness. Chaos will lay waste to civilization. I will never let that happen. Well, time to make something work. will funnel the bastards down into this one square. All right. They could outnumber us by a thousand to one here, but the confined space will take away that advantage. And that is true. God's really, Rome will see another dawn. Here they come. Hmm. Hold steady. All right, we're doing it. Oh, okay. Done. You know, I find it kind of amazing that, you know, even in a game set in ancient Rome, they were still able to find a way to include turret sections. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm working on it.
There is a lot of them. Yeah, I'm working on it. Turn. Yeah, I'm working on it. Turn. Try. Trying to go quick. Definitely a lot of them. I guess they weren't kidding. Oh, jeez. Uh, that's not good. Formation's broken. Yeah, this is it. My gods. There's no end to the filthy bastards. We have to hold them here. Fire at will! I'll lead the counter charge. I need every man we can spare. No, I will lead the charge. You'll never oh. make it back. I can hardly let you have all the glory now, can I? Oh. All right. Make sure to come back, to you. Well, off we go. Or off he goes, really. Whoa! Whoa, look at him go! Oh. Oh yeah, there she is. Oh, is he gonna get trampled by an elephant? Hey, that'll do it. Nice shot. No! Oh! Whoa, that was really close. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, that was, uh, that was, that's kind of a nice fake out there. Like, it looked like it was going to be, like, the dramatic death or whatever. Alright. Give me a shield. Gather reinforcements. 
Sir, the fourth cohort reserve has assembled, but our lines have broken. We have raiding parties operating throughout the city. All right, well. Understood. Guess I'm just gonna have to deal with that. Nice. All right, let us let us go forward. Oh, a real soldier to fight. Oh, Ah, man. Okay. Done. Gotta get the reserve. Lead your men through the forum. Both cohorts. Yes, sir. Yeah, come on. Warm up. Uh, I thought we were gonna like do a formation or whatever. This way. Anything up here? Anything at all? Ah. Ah, okay. That one is actually kind of hiding a bit. All right, crew. Let's, uh... We need to clear a way through. Vitalian is on the other side. All right. You there? Get to work. Yes, sir. You clear Three, out the barricade while I do things. Hmm. Legionnaires will fill the gap on the right, preventing barbarians from rushing in. the gap on the right, preventing barbarians from rushing in. Uh, we'll have them defend the left. Legionaries, take up a defense point on our left. Archers, take the left platform. Oh, well. Oh. Damn. Slash. Bonk. All right, sick. Yeah. 
Yeah, just keep uh, doing that. All right, see. All right, sick. Good work. You men. All right, let's move up. I will make haste to our commander. Rome shall not fall. Keep moving. Oh, whoops. Oh, well. Yeah. That uh, shield enemy is kind of stuck over there now. Hey. Yeah, I don't think they're supposed to be going through people. Done. Okay, I see you. Bonk. Oh. Bonk. Yeah, he's fighting. Oh no! Oh no! She got him. Well, that's a bad. Sign. Uh... Oh... Marius. Marius? Rise. Hey, is this lady again? There is still time. Oh, really? Your destiny awaits you. Look around you. How will I prevent the fall of Rome? I mean, you're not. All is lost. Don't waste time pulling off the petals. Cut off the head. Ooh. Good it comes. Oh. How'd I end up here? General, we can't hold them back for much longer. Boudica. Sir? Sir, I don't know for how much longer we can... Oh. Uh... Gods do not favor us. We must fall back. Flee. Is that why you left your post to tell me? Is that why you left your men? We have been summoned by the gods, and you want to flee? I should kill you myself. You bring dishonor to your men. You bring dishonor to me. You bring dishonor to Rome! I swear to you, Centurion, Rome will not fall. Not today. 
Today, we fight. Signal whatever's left of the 6th Legion to come about and reinforce the west flank. Pull the 5th out of the old quarter to do the same. Hmm. I'll find whatever's left of the 14th and take on the enemy in front of the palace. Go! Understood. The front line will hold. Yeah. Even if I have to hold it myself. Uh, oh, that was... <laughs> okay. A little swing. Alright, well. Off I go. This way, General! Boudicca's forces have overrun the Forum. What are your orders? We tear a hole in Boudicca's inner guard and eliminate her. When can I go back to my home? Hmm. Are you listening to me? Well, I would suggest kind of staying out of the way. I gotta scroll. Oh, Scorpio. Yeah, I see, I see. Fun of that. Get that gate open. Move up. Uh. You follow yeah, open the gate. Oh, nice. Let's go. Follow me. Yes, sir. Down there. Provide support. All right, I see. Grab some more Pila here. Uh, it's kind of looking out for anything of note. 
All right, let's go. Anything hiding out over here? Uh, yes, there is. I guess. Ah, okay. Yeah, some of the uh, collectibles seem uh, somewhat well hidden. Honestly. It's Boudica, sir, on the war elephant. She's trying to breach the palace defenses. You got another one? What artillery do we have? There's a Scorpio up on the ridge there, sir. Oh, okay. Oh, whoops. Yeah, I got uh, trampled by an elephant, I guess. It's Boudica, sir, on the war elephant. She's trying to breach the palace defenses. What artillery do we have? There's a Scorpio up on the ridge there, sir. Oh! Yeah, I don't know where it is. Yeah, I don't really know where the, uh... The thing is. It's Boudica, sir! On the war elephant! She's trying to breach the palace defenses! What artillery do we have? There's a Scorpio up on the ridge there, sir! Okay, maybe the goal is to just avoid the elephant. War elephant! Watch out! Another war elephant! Whoa. Oh, they got in my way! Like, I couldn't go through, like, the one way because they were coming back towards me. It's Boudica, sir! On the war elephant! That's, She's uh, that's... To breach the palace defenses. Oh, well. What artillery do we have? There's a uh, on the ridge it's just there, a matter sir. of, like, just getting past them. Really. Wait for them to fall through. Oh, how did I... Eh, whatever. Uh, I think I just have to be more mindful of where I am. It's Boudica, sir, on the war elephant. She's trying to breach the palace defenses. What artillery do we have? There's a Scorpio up on the ridge there, sir. Ow. Sir, those war elephants have two hits. This Scorpio is the only thing that will take them down. Okay. Uh, okay, that was a little close. Alright, come here. Whoa! Yeah, there she is. Oh, oh. or pay the price and let you destroy Rome never we can't both win and I've come too far to let you stand in my way straight up a, uh, a fighting game uh, a fighting game match intro Oh, 
Come on. Come on. Oh, man. Nice. Oh, that was... There we go. Hey, there we go. Oh, round two? Round two. So I guess I can't use the focus. I can only get like two hits on her at a yeah. time is a little annoying. I gotta roll away from that. Nice. Alright, we did it. Marius, son of Rome. Yeah. We are not much different, you and I. Fate has made us enemies. But in another life. In another life, perhaps. Not in this one. No. Not in this one.
Do it, Roman. Do it. Oh. Well. This from the highest place you can find. Yeah, and then a, uh, a flashback to the. Battle will be ours. And now we're back to the present. Since you're clearly not here to protect me, what now? You had my family murdered. You have left Rome in ruins. Everything that has happened, all this needless death, your jealousy, your vanity. Your arrogance has caused it all. Wait, 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 wait! Have you forgotten the Oracle's prophecy? Emperor Nero can only die by his own sword. You can't kill me. Only I can. You said so yourself. You languor the gods. Hmm. Hand me your dagger, General. Then I can at least die as an emperor. Even if I never lived as one. Yeah, this feels like a, a trick. You said the barbarians have been defeated. So, it's not them pounding up that door. Those are my Praetorians. God! God! Democles is here! He's here to kill me! Protect me! Oh, now. well. Ugh. All right, where are you? Marius, my good man. Oh, hey, how's it going? Do you have any idea how much trouble you've caused me? How hard I've worked to tease all these oh. pieces into place. Oh. Oh. Well, uh, I just got stabbed. Oh, well. Oh. Oh. Not gonna lie. Oh, whoops. Oh, what the... Uh. Yeah, let's try to actually, like, hit the things, yeah? Oh, wow. That's rough. Oh, nice. Hey. Yeah, that's pretty slick. Oh, that's less slick. Oh, whoops. Oh, 
Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Got him. Well. Oh, jeez. I have been stabbed a lot. <laughs> Whoa. Oh. That's rough. Well. Kind of looking like the end for me. Oh. healed, and her civilization once more grew and flourished. The city, saved by an unsung hero, would go on to stand for thousands of years. Rome would endure. From then, until the last days of man. Bum, bum. Hey, and that was uh, Rise, Son of Rome. Uh, okay. Let's sort of think about this. I, I liked the, like the look of it. You know, CryEngine games usually are kind of pretty to look at. Um. Some really interesting, uh, like, sequences and, and set pieces looked very, very nice. Um, the fact that they were able to find a way to put turret sections in <laughs> in our Rome game, I find just extremely funny. Um, the menu... I don't know. Like, the menuing of this game is kind of weird. Like, I understand what they were trying to do with, like, the seamless blend of, like, oh, being able to hop in and out of, of like, gameplay and, like, main menu. Like, I get that, but also... I don't know. I just found it kind of a pain to navigate. Maybe that's just me. Maybe I'm just not used to it. Also, somebody named Christopher Nolan is a level designer. That's funny. Um, you, uh... I think, like the, like the the beat 'em up gameplay is like fine. I, I think the the finishers are kind of neat to look at, even though they're just kind of set. 
they're essentially QTE sequences, kind of disguised to not look like QTE sequences. Because I think this was maybe like around the time or a little bit after the time when like there were a lot of people complaining about like QTEs in games. Like it was a thing you would see a lot in sort of, I, I want to say like late in the gen before. And then people were just kind of irritated about it. So maybe that's why they kind of did that. Or maybe they did it as like a stylistic choice. Where it's like, people understand, like, the color blue and the color yellow, you know? So, like, you know, maybe they're they're able to, to you know, we can at least do it like that and then. I guess, I guess not have uh, too big of a, of a problem. Yeah, it did. I I think the like I I think the Colosseum sequence was really interesting. Um, just like how the Colosseum was able to like morph so quickly in such a way was uh I don't know. Like it's really cool to see. Admittedly, I kind of wish it wasn't just kind of. Like a, a a Cliff Notes version of the the like the stuff that we were doing like before we came back to Rome, like doing all that stuff in in Britannia or whatever, or at least doing like a portion of it. Like it just I don't know. It's just kind of like I guess I kind of get it. Like. Oh, it's supposed to show how they're, like, embellishing, you know, their their successes. But also, I don't know. I, I think it gave, like, the, um, the opportunity to present something unique. And then it just kind of, I don't know. Like, they decided not to or they decided against it. Rise was not built in a day. It was an arduous campaign lasting seven years, and none of it would have been possible without our loyal friends, family, and fans. You honored us all with all your support. Oh, well, thank you. But yeah, like, overall, like... Like, I think the game is, like, fine. Like, I don't know if it... Like, I don't know how much it really does that, like, makes it stand out a ton. But it is, but it is competent. <laughs> um, I I know that sounds like a backhanded compliment, but like it's it's well done technically. It is, it has a competent design, you know. Like even when I was getting my my butt kicked by that one guy, like several times, like I felt like that was more just me being bad than, like, anything the game was doing. 
I, I do. I would dock points from having a, a premium currency that it could affect like the base game. I feel like that feels kind of like the actual like single player campaign. I, I don't know about that. And apparently this game has like a has like a co-op and like multiplayer thing, but I highly highly doubt you'll find anyone playing Rise Son of Rome. <laughs> I mean I mean nothing against it. It's just it doesn't really seem like those modes were really a big a big thing. You know what it kind of reminds me of? It kind of reminds me how like, I remember hearing that, um, that, like, some of the older Assassin's Creed games had, like, a multiplayer mode. So, like, like the, uh, some of the 360 Assassin's Creed's had, a uh, had, like, a multiplayer mode. And I'm sure it was probably fun, but also, like, like, who's, who's talking about Assassin's Creed multiplayer mode, you know? I don't know. But yeah, um, I don't know. I'm just kind of vibing out now. Vibing out. By the way, I was I was kind of surprised at just to like as a side note, I was kind of surprised how big the the file size of this game is. Like, I want to say it's it's like over like 30 gig, over 30, maybe over or close to like 35. Um, which is surprisingly pretty big. Like, it's not as big as, like, something like a Call of Duty game where, like, that those could be, like, like, 80 to, like, 100 games. Whatever the heck. Um, or, like, games are, like, 50 gigs, for example. But, like, I don't know. That, that still feels pretty sizable to me. Of course, maybe I'm still not used to games, like, taking up so much storage. Oh, yeah, I guess they did, uh... Yeah, they, I guess, yeah, they they would have been doing performance capture, yeah. Doing a bunch of mocap. Yeah, that definitely vibes. You know, I can't imagine that mocap is particularly deep. You know what I mean? Like, that that definitely seems like a tough thing to, like, do. Oh, they have credits for facial animation. That's actually really, really nice. Yeah, I guess that's kind of the other thing about mocap, is that, you know, uh... I, I would imagine that, like, you could, like, monitor, like, movement of, like, limbs and, and the body... But, like, facial movements are more, like... Like, those are, like, finer movements. And I'm sure that they probably have, like, some sort of, like, footage or model to, like, work off of. But I, I would imagine, at least 
you know, at least around this time that you would have to... You would have to, like, uh, get, like, an actual, like, th like, 3D animator to go in and... And make those, those facial animations. Because, like, there's a way to, like... From what I understand, there's, like, a method that, like, L.A. Noir used to get, like, facial capture, but it... From what I heard about it, it's very finicky. Like, it's very finicky and prone to not working. So, like... Well, you have to have, like, really, really controlled environment to make it work. So, like, I would, I would imagine that it's just less, probably cheaper or, like, less of a issue if you just get someone to just name that. That's cool. It's also crediting all the, uh, the other voice casts. That's neat. I like that. But yeah, I kind of like, I don't know, I kind of, I, I have a, uh, a proclivity towards, like, launch titles. I find launch titles very, very fascinating. Because it's like this, it, they're in, like, this interesting position of, like, okay, we're, like, in between console generations. Where it's like you get to be the first on our new new generation of hardware, so like So like there's incentive to like really like push the hardware, really show it off. But also like they always tend to be like a wider selection of games. Where it's like they try to cover a lot of different genres. Usually I would imagine because it's like, well, this is gonna be our new console. And our new console needs games. So, like, it, they need, like, something. Also, shout out to QA. No QA. Um, so, like, you have to... Like, you, you have to show off your... Like, what the console can do. But also, you need... Games that are actually, like... Reaching like a broad amount of control. And I don't know, it, they're they're just very very fascinating. Very, very fascinating. Ah, the crowd. Yeah, quite a lot of credits. 
quite a lot of credits. Of course, sir, Crytek had like a lot of developers on hand, so, so it's kind of nice to see to see them all. But yeah, I mean, oh yeah, I guess I should probably mention this. With with beating this game, we actually have now beaten more games this year than last year. Um, I think our total right now is 56. And last, last year we, we beat 55, so I mean, cool. Cool stuff. Really, you know, putting in the effort there. It may have been kind of wondering if I should, like, buckle down and do some, uh, some longer games. Sort of in the new year. Well, like, some games are, they're a lot, like, longer. I'd like to think that people enjoy that. But yeah, uh, they, but yeah, this was a, a fun time. This was a really, really, really fun time. Probably do one thing. All right. Uh, also, just I guess as a brief aside, uh, on the so in three days we're going to be having a last minute delivery 2023. Our uh, yearly 12 hour Euro Truck Sim to trucking stream. Uh, as part of that, we're going to be having our Christmas Sub Spectacular, which is going to be... Uh, there's uh, some sub goals. Some, some really nice sub goals. I hope you all are, uh, are uh, interested in, in that. Hey, development babies! See, I, I personally really like that. I like the crediting of uh, of uh, development babies. I, like, I think it's just cute. Okay, we're getting to the uh, software licenses. So, uh, I think we're close to the end of the credits. Expat XML parser. JPEG Group Library. Incredible. Oh, Lua is here? Everyone is here. Huh. Fast LZ Compression Algorithm. Ta-da! Good?
Do I have to actually, like, press the button? Oh, wait, no. Okay. Yeah, okay. It's just gonna put me here. Well, uh, I'm... I think I'm good for tonight. I don't know about you, chat. Uh... I don't know. Who's doing... Thing? Oh, I, well... Well... Mm, okay. Uh, I think I know who to bother. Because they're cool. Uh, but yeah, let me... Set that up. Anyway, uh, thank you for coming out. I appreciate you. And, uh, I think without further ado... Let us, uh... Shoot, what was the read? <laughs> My brain kind of shut off there for a second. But anyway, let's uh, roll it over now to the aftermath. So, uh, so what we learned today? We learned that the uh, the machinations of gods can be uh, rather complicated overall. We also learned that. Uh, that nothing fuels people more than spite and vengeance. We also learned that, uh, that sometimes games just offer premium currency for free. Because, like, why not? No one's buying it anyway. Anyway, thank you for coming out to the Uncle Bandit stream. If you enjoyed streams like this, don't be afraid to leave a follow. If you want to help support the stream, you can also sub and donate. Those things really help me out. If you want to check out any old playthroughs or keep up with any current playthroughs, you can head over to the Uncle Bandit stream archive over on YouTube.com. And if you want to keep up with any stream updates, so like playthrough announcements, or just want to see what I'm up to, you can check me out on Twitter at Uncle underscore Bandit. This has been it for me. This has been it for Rise, Son of Rome. And I hope to see you all next time. <laughs>